This playthrough is rated E for everyone. Greetings and salutations, viewers. All of my back here with another episode of Threads of Fate. In the last episode, we, uh, Prima Doll got captured, Mint saved us, and it looked like we learned a little bit about things, and then we found Claire, a shadow of herself, but the Psycho Master either knew about it, or tricked us, or whatever, and now we're, uh, we have to go save her. But before we do that, you know what I just realized? I forgot to grind for money off screen. Oh well. Yeah, I was supposed to do that so I could buy the police equipment and I forgot to do that. Uh, I still forgot what it looks like this one. I heard the Princess May was at the tower, so I went there to see her. When I got there, I was sent away by a man with pointy red hair. Wait a minute, that sounds familiar. Yeah, it could, could be. I heard a strange cry from the lake. Maybe there are monsters in that tower. I'm kinda scared. You better go find them, kid. You have to face your fears. I haven't seen those puzzles for a while. I wonder where they went. Oh, yeah, I forgot about those dorks. Yeah. I heard the Princess May was at the to Oh, and I thought, do you say anything new? Oh, what good are you? Bam! Punch him in the face. Hey, dude. Ah, we're way too eager. You might end up dead if you don't take a deep breath and calm down. Learn the secret of longevity is composure. And dancing. Okay, don't ask, you know. Yeah, sorry. That's something in that my throat. Alright, and I don't think. I know we fought Raw the last episode, but I'm trying to sink since that got finished if there was any there. He probably didn't have a new weapon, but I do want to fight it really quick. Usually I just do this off screen, but... Oh, did... Whoops. <laughs> I accidentally put that instead. Alright, anyway. I keep, like, one to press the button, like, really quick, and I press it so quick that when it comes to it... It's weird how negative is the top one. Uh, depending on the game, sometimes I like the fact that that's the case, but uh, and other times I'm like annoyed. But say I might just—I'm surprised he missed me, frankly. I gotta beat him really quick so I can have just enough money to. Uh... Wait, come on! Oh, I did not know we could do that. Huh? Did we just destroy his house or his tent or whatever it is? Because. God now. Hey, I didn't destroy it, dude. You did. Alright. I only did that because I, I could actually afford, like, one of the pieces. The pieces of eight. No, one of my armors. Uh, actually, before we go to the tower, let's talk to this Klaus or his family have anything to say. Hey, oh, Mira. If you're planning to go into the tower, make sure you're prepared. I have a feeling you run some major challenges there. Like, how would I prepare? I mean, other than, like, uh, Buying the best equipment and grinding for money. I don't see how else I could really go for it than that. Really? I can't ask anyone but you. Please go ask the team at all. You can't do anything about that? I didn't think my search for the relic will lead to this. Yeah, you're... Kind of suck. Princess May of East Heaven. What is the Princess of East Heaven doing here? She is the princess, so she can do whatever she wants. Really? Don't blame yourself. It's not your fault. I didn't blame myself. Okay. I gotta keep... I don't know, I'm just so used to games just having one line of dialogue for people for every section that when there is a possibility for more dialogue, I just don't, can't think of, uh, talking to them further. Please don't do anything reckless. Even Vince is taking some precautions. What? No, that's not true. I don't believe you. Lies. Don't lie to me, Mira. Why don't you leave your husband in? I mean, uh, oh, never mind. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just messing around. Uh, let's see, the tr another church, I know nothing, nothing on the thing there. Those guys, you don't say anything. Now we go, go ahead, before we go to the tower, might as well buy some equipment. Oh, I thought I had more money, huh. Hmm, I must have been thinking of something. Well, could I? I mean, at this point, should I even keep any of this, like, stuff? I might go ahead and just sell the Nightstone, even though there's probably something to it, but... I just want to have something before we go to the next area, like... Like, uh... Well, at least the Mithril Belt. I can kind of survive with, uh... No, uh... No hard hitting damage, you know? Because that just means it takes longer, but at least with the defense, it'll... It'll keep me covered. Let's see, I assume the bar has nothing new to say. Usually they don't. Which is kind of sad, really. I don't know, maybe there's, there's a game made now, or at least uh, made in the PS2 era. Maybe there would have been more to it or something like that. Because, you know, with the 
PS1 and all that, you had to... I'd say you have to restrict, but then again, Fall, oh wait, no, Final Fantasy VII was on three discs. Final Fantasy VIII was on four. Never mind that. Although those are still large games, but they still have to be split up. Yeah. Wait, no, oh, never mind, I forgot. Yeah. I was thinking for a second, I was like, well, I thought about selling my coins. Yeah, I forgot this guy could sell your coins. If, if you want to sell like the bronze coins and all that, you can, but uh, probably not a good idea. You never know how, how badly or how good I'm going to do up ahead. Alright, I guess we got to go to the next section. Or the tower. Oh, wait. Before we go to the tower, one more thing. I got rest because uh, Rod, Rod kind of uh, beat me up a few times. Alright, cover. And I'm not going to save it just because I can just use a coin in, in the dungeon to restore it. I have quite a few bronze coins, so it should be fine. Um, uh, yeah, let's just go to the Tower of Maya. I mean, there might be some extra stuff you can do, so... I'll admit, this this uh, playthrough is definitely not going to be as thorough as I'd like it to be, but... Yeah, I'm probably missing, like, a ton of treasures and things like that, but... I don't want that to hold me back from the, that Claire I'm coming. Phrasing? No, uh, okay, so... Yeah, I thought she was, her soul was, like, stuck in him or something like that, but the fact that she has a physical body, I wonder, I wonder if that happened. Well, we're gonna get we're gonna get revenge. That's the that's the lesson to teach the children. <gasps> Exclamation point question mark. Oh hey. What voice did I give again? Hey, what's up? Oh no. Hey, what's up, fool? I don't know why I just like the word fool to to like degrade someone. Fool! No. Be just like the dumb fish that you are. Trap master. Oh yeah, his name was Trap Master. It's been a hot minute since we've seen him so you're one of them. <laughs> no, duh. You're scared now, huh? Or did I give him the... Whoa! Nah, I think I did the deep voice for him. Where do you think you're going? What, what do you... What, do you think you can just walk out of here? Dumb. Very, very dumb. And... Oh, are we fighting? Are we kung fu fighting? Oh, okay then. You ain't going nowhere. Okay. I guess I just can't leave? All right. Because if I attack him, I hit damage, so... <laughs> About time he caught on. Hmm? What do you mean? What are you gonna do? Don't even think about escaping. I rigged this door with a little surprise. You got no choice but up. Oh, no, oh. Oh, wait, that's not too bad, actually. It's just a flying bunny with, with angel wings. With a Sephiroth complex. Oh, oh, Sephiroth! So don't set me wrong, see result. Oh wait, that's there. I guess I can just. You know it's been a while since I've. Oh, pumpkin! What the? It's over. How many already passed, dude? A little late for that. Yeah, well, actually, it's been like a week or so since Halloween. So, what are the odds? Or actually, yeah. yeah, yeah. Actually, I guess I can just ignore these guys, but eh, might as well try to beef up. Actually, uh, I could. Uh, Hold to blow up. Really want to blow up. Let's see if any of these will give me like a magic increase. It, uh, it's been a while since I've quite messed with my magic. So. Yeah, it doesn't look like this. Is good. Yeah, that didn't... At least it gives you double kill. Okay, let me see what uh. Let me see what the pumpkin thing does. Okay, what does it do again? Collide. So you can run into it. Hold the blow up. Does that kill me? Or does nothing? Does that do anything? Alright. Before I die, I'm gonna swap back, because that was pointless. Thanks for that game. Thanks for trying to kill me with the uh, with abilities I don't understand. Yeah, I'm kinda of surprised that the trap master just laying any is. I was about to say, I'm surprised he didn't just attack me, but he is called Trap Master, not, not Kung Fu Fighting Master. So there's Psycho Master, Trap Master. Who are the others again? Or did we even meet them, come across them? Kind of, I bet Mint probably comes across like some of the other masters during her, during her journey. I assume I have to jump on it. Oh, is that Trap Master throwing crap at me? Or, okay. Wait, did I jump on like the wrong pumpkin or something? I trailed through the pumpkin patch. 
but I didn't see anything. Ow. It, oh, if you fall off, you have to fight it. So this is testing my platforming skills in this game that I'm already terrible at. Oh my god. In my depth perception apparently is really bad, and yet I've got the TV like right in front of my face, so you think I'd be I think I'd be a bit more like aware. Oh, I could switch to that. Uh, could switch to the bunny thing or whatever it's called. Like, a wabbit. Sorry, killed a wabbit, killed. That was terrible jumping. Kill the wabbit, kill the wabbit, kill the wabbit. This is gonna be, this is gonna be annoying, guys, like, folks. Wait, oh, you have to jump on them in order? Oh no, can't cheat this system, can ya? Reamer, reamer, frazzin' fraggin' wabbit. Oh wait, it's not your fault. Wait, what? That was the wrong one? Well, how can you tell? Or is there just fake one? I don't know. So you just have to... Okay. Ah! Nuts! Ah, I'm not trying to do this on purpose, folks. I'm just... You know, just ah. And now I can't really blame my control on this. It's just me just not... Not, uh... uh so how do you tell which one to jump on? Well, obviously not. So just trial and error. There's got to be an obvious like, hey, you should do this, you know, or you should jump on this one. But blather and blather Skype. I never thought you'd hear that. Yeah, that's one I haven't seen in a while. Uh, she throws pumpkins at you. She she just loves Jack the Pumpkin King. Jack. Oh, she's shooting him out of a cannon. I'm gonna shoot you out of a cannon into the sun. She have powers? Oh, it's a. Oh, I guess that makes one. Wait, you could. Oh, it's even. It's even. Uh, like stuck there. You know what I mean? Or you can spin too. Spin to win. She's playing with legends. That was. Actually, she didn't need the HP that bad. Alright, trap. Wait, trap mess? Oh. Seriously? Uh, uh, this isn't gonna be one of my good days, is it? No, sir. Actually, really, a PlayStation 1 and older games will kind of hold that out to me, because I'm so used to, like, modern game design and everything like that, that, you know, sometimes you forget, like, the, the clunkiness or weirdness of older titles, you know? Yeah, it's kind of funny. You know, I like to... You know, I'm having trouble with this, yet I've beaten games like Sekiro and Dark Souls and all these other games. So just keep that in mind. Although Sekiro did take a lot of practice. And, uh, okay, I should probably just leave. It's going to keep... They're going to just keep responding. Although, I'll admit, Sekiro was one of those games I didn't... I didn't really figure out until maybe like halfway through the game, and then I kind of finally figured out how to really play the game, if that makes sense. I knew it was not going to supposed to be a hack and slash game because, you know, I've, I'd seen that from like reviews and other sorts of things. But then, just at some point, I didn't really get that until like like a certain terrible, bo uh, like a tough boss. I forgot what boss it was that really, I really had to like buckle down and really figure out the game. Otherwise, I wasn't going to beat him. I'm trying to remember what boss. It might have been like the, uh, might have been like the, the well, I, I don't know if I want to say it because I don't want to spoil like some of the bosses in the game if you, if you ever play it yourself, that type of thing. But. Let me just say, uh, let me just say a person who was, uh, who lost, uh, lost their head. If that makes any sense. Uh, okay, so this one just is just used for, re for, uh, am I supposed to? Uh, a little bunny wabbit is, is knocking me off my perch. Oh, I'm so, oh, okay, so I have to basically jump onto the next platform in time. Well, can I kill him before here, or will they respawn? Let me see if I can kill that pumpkin can. Oh, okay, that's not gonna work. I mean, it might work for a minute, but not not really, not very long. Like, can I? That's not helpful. Okay, I can't do that. 
Oh, I could do the... I do have Mr. Freeze still. Or uh, Spectre. And Spectre Gadget? He is kind of lanky like him, so why not? Wow. Okay, let's just straight up. Oh, come on. There we go. I just had to, like, kind of just go for it, you know? Come on! Oh, at least that knocked him off, so... At least the, the, the wabbit gets, uh, gets messed with a bit. There we go. Wow, apparently the game expects me to get hurt multiple times because, uh, uh, it gets to give me healing. So. The game has, the, the game's lack of faith is disturbing. <laughs> Your lack of faith in the is disturbing. Or how it goes. Yeah. Your faith in your friends is yours. I can't really do a good Palpatine. Towards the docks and will be complete. Nah, is that better? <laughs> nah, no, not much better. Yeah, I'll probably lay off on the magic. I don't know why. Maybe Mint's, Mint's magic use will be better overall. Than the Cause I don't know why with uh, with Rue uh, or Rue. I don't know. I keep saying it. I think it's Rue just because Rue would be R U, not R U E. I didn't really, I don't think I ever really took a, a, a like, really good advantage of Rui, Rui's, uh, transformation, you know? I don't know, I feel like even though I can do it and I know to do it, like, I'm not really losing it. Like, I'm just so used to using base form Rue that, like, it just seems the most, uh, um, best, uh, the best way to go, so. Yeah, this must be usually must be considered a hard area because they're giving you. I'm surprised they're giving us recoveries like every floor. Then again, you can't buy potions and heal yourself, so I guess this is really other than killing monsters or whatever. Claire, oh, they let you go. Well, thanks, guys. Claire, time to make out. It's about time I got my booty duty. I mean, uh, dot 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 dot. I still can't believe it. I've missed you so much. Hold my hand. Come, grab my hand. Grab my hand. Come on, let's go home. Why are you laughing? Exclamation point, exclamation point, exclamation point, question mark. Well, that's not very, that's kind of rude. <laughs> that's not a very good laugh. Claire, what's wrong? Why are you laughing? <laughs> Just look at you, crying a little baby, Claire, Claire. You're so cute, how can anyone not laugh? Who are you? Hold on one sec. Whoa! Well, that was an image to be behold. Oh, she's kind of cutie. Although, our, I mean, our hearts declare, but uh, I'm a sucker for the Chinese dress. Voila! I am Mode Master. Mode? Mode Master? Mood Master. Thank you so much, Rue. I had so much fun pulling your leg. Why? Are you just a jerk? Are you wearing stockings? Why else? To who you here? It was like a charm. You're so full of passion. Please don't touch a grudge, okay? I have to admit, I became very envious of Claire. To be cherished so much that you risk your life for her. She must have been a very special lady. All she, I think all she did was feed us and take care of us, so I I mean, that's special, but you know what I mean? I think it's a little blown out of proportion. Or Rui is just super affectionate, like a dog, you know? Shut up! Wow, you almost straight up murdered a Oh. Stay your hand, Rue. This is almost like finding a zombie version of Rue. It said he can't, he just can't hurt that. You do know she's not Claire. Like, there's no reason, no way she's Claire. Why would you hold back? What, you got PTSD about Claire? I mean, that's a serious disease, but still. Uh, poor baby, you know, you can't do it there. Uh, you got to do it. And that's, that is why you are weak. Um, uh, I don't know who's talking here. How oh, pitiful. Is that Trap Master, maybe? Or Mint? You thought Claire was alive! Or that's Doll Master. You came here desperately hoping that she actually came back to life. Or come back to life. Now your hope has been shattered. Claire's dead. 
that's the bat. Damn you! Super Saiyan? I mean... Yes, I can sense it. I feel your rage piercing my bones. I'm so <laughs> I'll give it to your heart and the darkness of the dark side. Your journey through. Give it to your rage and your journey to the dark side will be complete. There, that was apropos. But that's not enough. There's much greater power resting in you. Shut up. I don't care. I will help you bring it out. Do you remember this? He just... He just... Big, man, uh, big hand man. That hand. Man, I do not want to... Uh, I do not want a handshake or a handy from that thing. That's for sure. I can't. God, that's so creepy. Look at that. That's right. Don't want to play patty cake with this guy. Holy crud. That's right. I killed Claire. And we're about to die. Oh. Spice my employee time six. He's dead. You're dead! Dead! <laughs> You're not alive! That's impossible! more Star Wars jokes or references can I make today, folks? Rage has awakened you just like three years ago. Now your his hand can stop your sword. Man. Uh I'm not gonna high five you dude. Or are we we technically are high five aren't we? I'll tell you right now, you can never defeat me. That's what they all say. But is this one true? Oh well okay we'll find out if I can beat the hand man. Why is he called Dollmaster if he can just summon a big-ass hand? I don't know. Oh, well. Actually, can I get knocked off? And I guess I'm in power of or whatever. Oh, yeah, I gotta remember. I can't just go hack it. I just can't go hack and slash him. Yeah. Usually it seems... Oh, whoa! Okay. Uh, I think I got knocked off, but somehow I got pushed back. Okay, so two attacks seem to... Oh, well. That was probably a bad sign. A bad call to do that. I thought he's gonna have a life bar. I wasn't trying to. Ah, I, I just want to do it twice and you know, I like somehow. Uh, nope, no, no, come on. There we go. Ow! I keep doing the. the oh, well, I might have to be doing this fight again. Ah, uh, no, no! This one's at. Oh, ouch. Alright, we gotta try that one again. Nuts. Okay, so. One or two strikes at best, and then jump or avoid or whatever. Or we can't win. Oh, I wonder if you can beat him. It's been a while since I've played this. I don't really quite remember. I told you, you could never defeat me. Uh, he's in the castle of... Uh, hey, who's that in the background? It's time for the final step. Dollmaster, what are you doing? What's going on? Exclamation point, question mark. I didn't know you were into that type of thing. I mean, uh, don't mess with me. Good of you to come, Your Highness. I was just about to call you from your chambers. Yeah, right. But just what happened here? Answer me at once. Yeah, she knows how to be a princess. She's definitely taking charge. Very well. You are no longer of any use to me. I was wondering why this was going to happen. Exclamation point, question mark. Darn, your inevitable but uh, obvious betrayal. Or however it goes. I forgot. Oh, sorry. Psycho Master, get the book! Dang, Prince, you got knocked around pretty easily. What are you princess of again? What do you think you're doing? I'm just sitting here like a lump on a wall. Or, yeah, bump on a wall. Now, Rue, show me your true power. Show me Super Saiyan 2! <laughs> Should be use a perfect cell voice. Yes! Perfect cell! Gizmo equals guy equals Gias. Kogias? No, no, that'd be, that'd be, that'd be kind of interesting. But... To the born of do I command. Accept your destiny, release your powers. It is your destiny. Not the book of Cosmos. Uh oh. That's it. Tear the book apart. Why would we do that? Is it gonna destroy the cosmos? My 
goodness, the book is being destroyed. And we died. Well, maybe it did die. I don't know. It could be in Purgatory or, or the Great Beyond. Eh, it's a, it was a fun life. What is this place? Hey, Maya. It's, it's the Book of Cosmos. Hmm? Well, if I had to be stuck in here with a pretty lady like yourself, that's not all the bad. The Book is a gateway to the cosmos. Right now, you and I are in space. In space! Wait, can't we not breathe in space? Are we gonna die of hy hypoposia or pagia or whatever? You're. Ugh. My goodness, Dollmaster showed you no mercy. Show no mercy. <laughs> Sweep the leg. Try to stay still. Got how many movie references I'm gonna do today? I don't know why I'm just in a reference mood today. Thank you. I must say, I'm impressed. Or surprised. You're associated with my sister, yes. Uh, very loosely. Uh, yeah, we know who your sister is. I figured you'd be hopeless ruffian, just like her. No, we actually have self-respect. Her sister? Yeah, you know who it is, folks. I mean, it's pretty obvious, if you didn't see the intro to the game. I still can't believe it. The Book of Cosmos has been dismantled. The book is an Aeon relic. Dollmaster is a powerful magician, but he couldn't have done this. It's impossible. It's not true. The book must have been dismantled by something else. Me? I mean, my power did do something. Rui, it was you. Oh, okay. There's incredible power resting within you. Dot, dot, dot. Yeah, I'm awesome. The glowing stone on your forehead. Yeah, it's fashionable. It will be again in ten years. It doesn't look like an ordinary stone. I believe it holds tremendous powers. Like a Dragon Ball. Dun, dun, dun. I don't know anything about this stone. Actually, I don't know who I am. I don't know who I am. Uh, there, there are, let's say, I am thou, thou art I, or whatever. Anyway, I don't understand anything. I, I don't know anything about myself. Come with me. We'll go see Atanasius. Wait, we were sent to space. How are we going to get back from space? Atanasius? He's the Aeon who created the Book of Osmos. I'm sure he'll be able to answer all your questions. We can talk to an Aeon? I thought all I thought Aeons were all dead. All dead. Why don't uh, why don't Aeons like jokes? Because they're all dead. <laughs> You're right. Or, You're right. Atanasius died a few hundred years ago. But just before his death, Atanasius sealed his spirit in the Book of Cosmos. To this day he still resides there. What a life that is. No is his in spirit. He's with us in spirit. I just realized I keep forgetting that this game model uses big, big old feet. Do you really think he would know anything about me? Atanasius is a powerful Aeon. There's nothing that he doesn't know. Even my sizes. You know what I mean. In any case, we must see him. Without his help, we won't be able to escape from this world. I am here. And more! In 10,000 years, we'll give you real crimp of the neck! No, can't really do a good, good, uh... That's Atanasius? Yes, er, yes, as you can see, Atanasius has merged with the Book of Cosmos. So wouldn't dismantling him have killed the guy? Or destroyed his spirit? Your Highness, what has happened? Oh yeah, I gotta remember he fluctuates his, the last... He fluctuates the first and last uh, letter. My great test creation has been destroyed in the, the blink of an eye. I am not going to keep doing that. What power in this world is capable of such a feat? I'm not sure, but I believe the stone on this man's forehead caused this. We're a man, not a boy? I thought we were like a teenager. This chaos started when that glowing stone began to shine, shine brilliantly. What? What did your favorite color? Atanasius? You. That stone. Yes, 
that stone has the power to destroy my book. My book. Please tell me, what is the stone? Bah, just looking at that wretched stone disgusts me. Of course you are his servant. He has sent you here to destroy me. Servant? I don't understand. You cannot fool me. There is no doubt you are Balin's servant. Is that why we want to find the relic so badly? We're related to some Balin in a way. Balin's servant? Silence! Your evil intentions are obvious. You plan to destroy me. There's a red face to acquire that doom prison. Doom prison? Doom pr yeah, exactly. He knows what I'm thinking. I will not allow it. Never. That relic will will only invite disaster. Bigland must not be resurrected. I must stop you at all costs. Tenacious, uh, stop this at once. It's too late. Time for boss battle, right? Uh, yep, indeed we do. Time to fight Atenacious. Next time in the next episode of Threads of Fate. Hopefully we survive. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And I'll see you next time. Ah, that's not good.